Hello. Um, welcome. This is Bear with Adina, the channel on YouTube, about you bearing with me because I might say something dumb, I might do something dumb, and you're just like, really? And I'm going to be like, well, you know, I tr I'm trying my best. Please bear with me. And um, yeah, also trying to find my niche. So that's a thing that's also happening. But today I wanted to talk about my future. <laughs> um, three things that I want to work on in the next 10 years is um, traveling. I want to travel more. I want to find my definition of home. I want to just, just feel more free than what I feel now. I realize I'm not a city girl anymore. I do enjoy the city life sometimes, but not all the time. I would like to just leave. If I could live the cottage life for the rest of my life, I would. I would because it's comfortable. It's it's nice. It's near water. I love water. I love swimming. I'm not the greatest swimmer, but I love swimming. Um, and I love just looking out at nature and seeing how pretty it is. But I will kill every bug out there. So you know, there's a there's a mix up here. There's a, there's there's definitely a mix up, and there's something that I just have to live with, I guess. Um, yeah, I just bring a lot of bug spray, a lot of, you know, the incense that kills them and stuff. Yeah, just get rid of them. We'll work it out. Um, um, and yeah, just traveling to different places. Like, I want to go to Iceland, I want to go to Italy, I want to go to Japan, New Zealand, Australia, Sweden, Norway, uh, Switzerland, uh, been to France, but I would love to go to the south of France. I mean, there's more things to do in France. I want to go to Amsterdam. I want to go back to Belgium because I didn't get to explore Belgium, you know? I, I want to go to the... Do I want to go to the UK? Yeah, I, I mean, I've been... I feel like I've seen everything, but I don't know. Maybe I want to do a, a, a tea party, you know? Just something... something very English. Um... Ireland, you know? Ugh. South America, Brazil, Peru, Argentina, you know, I've been to Guyana. Guyana is beautiful. Um, the Caribbean, I've been to Jamaica, I want to go back. Uh, I've been to the Bahamas. It's beautiful, beautiful water too. Beautiful people. Um, yeah, I just want to check out other places. Trinidad and Tobago, you know, uh, St. Lucia. Barbados, all of them, you know, and then, I mean, there's some states that I want to see in the United States, like, uh, California, I want to go to, I want to go to Nevada, I want to go to New Mexico, I don't know, just drive through it, see what it's like, um, I want to do, I want to do Texas, but I, can I just tell them that I'm Canadian and I'll be okay, is that, is that okay? Like, would they, would they accept me? I don't know. I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> um, want to go to Atlanta? I know they have really good roller rinks there, you know? And like, I hear the strip clubs are amazing. So, yeah. I want to, yeah, I want to find my destination of my home somewhere else. I've been to New York. New York is beautiful. It's beautiful. Beautiful people. Great food. You know, I love, I love their hustle. Okay. Hustle culture is tiring, but I kind of like their hustle culture. It's, it's more extreme, but I don't know. It's, it's so, I don't know. The life they live is interesting and cool. I don't know. I think New York, New York people are cool. Um, cool styles too. Swag, all that stuff. Um, where else? Been to Washington, Virginia. Um been to not I don't, know. I don't know where else I would go I've been to Florida Florida's fun as a kid I mean it could be fun as an adult too actually it was fun as an adult I went for my 21st birthday yeah it was good times good times um I don't know where else to go 
I'd figure it out. There's more. There's more. Um, I there's more European countries, obviously. Um, more Asia countries. I want to do those like uh, those like specific island countries too, like Fiji and stuff. It's like beautiful, expensive as hell, but beautiful. I would love to go one day. If I'm able to like just travel and show you guys, like even like um, show hotels and stuff in areas and whatnot, I'd be like, yeah, great, I'll go. I'll go, I'll show it off, I'll be like, yeah, this is this is amazing, guys, you should definitely, you know, tell you all the good, the pros, the cons, everything, like, you know, it'd be beautiful, beautiful. I want to hike and go to a stone cabin. I hear it's very cold, though. But we can make a fire, it's fine. We can have blankets and sweaters, figure it out, you know. Um, so yeah, that's the travel bit. The travel bit is very... is something that I need money for, so I'm gonna be working towards that. And then, um, art. Art is has been my dream since I was young. When I was a kid, I would always be in a corner drawing and, and doing some type of art, you know? I was very, um, I still am very into anime. So my dream at first was to be a veterinarian, but then the idea of euthanizing an animal kind of hurt me. So I was like, no, I'm not doing that. And then I moved on to animation and I really loved drawing and animating like stuff. And um, I'd make like little videos and stuff. And then, I don't know, by college, I didn't fully have the skill set. I'll be honest. And so I wanted to just not, well, I still wanted to do it. It was in my heart of hearts. And then I was like, oh, you know, maybe, maybe illustration then if I can't get into animation. And I was like, oh no, no, I'm close. I don't want to squeeze it. And then, you know, there's certain aspects of my life where people are saying, oh, I'll just do a graphic design. Do graphic design is another form of art. It's more practical. We'll get back into that another time. And, um, yeah, it's still, I don't know if animation is still a dream of mine, maybe down the road or something, but I still, I still love drawing. I still love putting my art, well, I don't put my art out there as much, but I should. I, I'm getting back into the motion of drawing again and stuff, and so, like, I am, I'm looking at studies and I'm looking at you know, real life. I should go, now that it's more um, warmer and stuff, I should go out now and just start drawing real life, real people. Just sit in the park and just draw and kill the bugs around me and, and yeah. Um, also Skillshare. Skillshare is another place not sponsored uh, that I have been using to up my art a little bit and stuff. Um, just a little side note here, so you guys just know who I am. I have the brain rot of Satoru and and Ghetto, uh, Ghetto and Gojo, uh, Satoru, Gojo, and Subaru Ghetto. I'm brain rot is real. I can't stop thinking about them. They're all over my timeline on Twitter. Um, it's a personal Twitter. Um, I might make one for Bear with Diva. I I don't know yet. I I just don't wanna. See, so story time, because you must know. Um, I made a business account thinking that I'd do the business, but I didn't end up doing the business, and now it's just like a Satoru and Suguru account. Yeah, yeah, it's just an account for their art, basically, or just any anime boy art. I love Yuri. Yuri is great as well, but I, I, you know what? Please put in recommendations for Yuri, because I, I really like the anime Bloom Into You. It was so cute. I, I really enjoyed that one. I enjoyed reading Citrus. I didn't enjoy watching it, though. I don't know. The anime wasn't, I don't, and it was following the manga, so I don't know why I didn't really enjoy it. I have to go back to it and see if, whatever. And then, mmm. 
Yeah, so in terms of art, I think that's pretty much it. I wanted to start businesses and stuff, and, and like stickers and, and prints and, and like other big stuff, and, and just sell it to people. But I don't know if I want to do fan art. Like, I, I want to do, okay, this is what I'm thinking. Tell me how you feel, you know, and what comes forth. I think that I could start with maybe a sticker company right like uh maybe fan art and stuff but i maybe mm, okay i'm thinking one company can be fan art and then another company can be like personal stuff like personal art projects because this summer i'm trying to focus on doing a one-shot manga um maybe in another video i can just show you the drawings that I have so far and like you can diss my art like I don't care I'll care but just be nice to me <laughs> I'm very fragile um, <laughs> um yeah so in terms of that I just that was also another dream of mine manga becoming a mangaka and I just never got around to doing it also because I'm very bad at sorry I'm just positioning myself again um I'm just very bad at uh, manga so something that I'm really needing to focus on and, and just uh, study up more and Skillshare again, still not sponsored. Um, yeah, um, in terms of art, that's it. I don't know, just like, just like tell me like you, what makes the most sense because I know if you start fan art as a business, like, yes, you're going to get growth, obviously, on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, Blue Sky, all that, all that jazz. And, and then, but I just don't always want to stick to fan art. At some point, I'm going to get sick of doing that. Um, even when I'm drawing Gojo and Ghetto, I'm like, okay, I kind of want to do my own thing now, you know? And it's just like... I love receiving the art from other people, but I don't necessarily want to continuously do fan art forever and always. So it's it's about getting to that point of how do I just focus on the things that I want to do versus the fan art stuff. Does that make sense? I feel like I'm kind of rambling. Probably am rambling. I'm just going to post this, by the way. So I you're going to get all the ums and blah, 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 blah. Bear with me. I I also need to learn how to edit videos too, so that's why you guys are gonna keep getting these types of videos. <laughs> um yeah. Um so in terms of art, that's what I'm wanting to do. Because I wanna I wanna go to cons and I wanna I wanna sell stuff, right? And I've always been a nervous person. Also, I need money, so I'm, I'm looking for work. Um, I have a part-time job, but I'm not getting enough hours, unfortunately. So, time to look for more, right? Um, so, that's what I'm working towards at the moment. And, um, yeah. And, uh, what else? I want to... My last thing, I guess, on the list. It's a kind of a personal one, but maybe you you've also been through something like this as well, where I'm I'm very distant with family and friends and other loved ones, and um, I'm not good at reaching out to people. So that's something that I want to improve in the next ten years. Letter to self: This is what I want to do in the next ten years. Um, so when you're seeing this, when you're 38, because I'm 28 now, did you? <laughs> did you do good? <laughs> I hope you did. I hope you work towards having better relationships and, 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 you know, getting to a place where you can love yourself enough to love others just as much, you know? I feel like everyone goes through that though. I feel like I'm not in the boat alone. I feel like people are also trying to, ouch, sorry, yeah, nicked my foot, uh, are also in the, um, 
in the boat of feeling like they're alone, but they're not actually alone. Shy surprise, right? And so, yeah, um, that's basically what are the three major things that I want to work on um, as I get older in the next 10 years, you know? Um, obviously health is important. I'm going to start working on that stuff as well. So these are like three many things that I'm going to be working on. It's health, finding new hobbies, um, what's the third thing? YouTube! <laughs> I guess YouTube would count as a new hobby, right? Uh, yeah, I've always said I wanted to make a channel, but I, I never got to it until now. Until now, so, yeah. Um, anyway, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for being an active participant in the comments. Um, I hope to speak to you too soon in another video. Um, subscribe, like the video. <laughs> I don't know if you want to, it's a, whatever. Uh, if you just want to watch, just watch. Enjoy it, you know? Um, and yeah, I'm maybe, I don't know. I have so many ideas, but I just don't know how to, like, focus them and stuff. I know YouTubers, like, make documents on what they want to talk about and stuff. I just wanted to talk. I just wanted to chill with you guys. Um, and I, and I wanted to just... Say what I wanted to say. <laughs> so, yeah. Thank you for bearing with me. Um, and hope to see you in the next video. Bye. Ciao.